I was gonna do that right about now anyway. So fuck How many of y'all ever seen me before? A couple of you? Awesome. Hey, what's up, guys? Don't look so sad, man. Well, I'll be up soon. It's gonna be okay. How many of y'all have only seen me on the internet before? Uh, how many of y'all have no idea who this fucker is that's sweating and yelling at you? Great. Good. So, this is the part of my show where I do a thing called freestyle rapping. In order to know that I'm indeed making up all the rap lyrics that go along, I want you guys to give me things to rap about and I'll rap about them, but there are rules. I can't rap about anything anyone else ever rap about before because there's so many awesome songs about cars and guns and butts and how much Mac Miller loves pizza. I can't rap about anything I've ever rapped about before because you're going to hear more songs about girls, whiskey, and American history and not paying attention to cops or government. And I can't rap about anything that's going to get me arrested because I'm a pussy. Cool. So you got to raise your hands as well because this is a fucking democracy. Yes, for the Christ's sake, before you explode. What's that? The Russian fucking meteorite. Did you guys see that shit? Man. Isn't it really awesome when you just have one of those moments where you're like, holy shit, we are fucking hurtling through space right now. God damn it, we are this close to just being fucking decimated at any given time. I fucking love it. Isn't that thrilling? Doesn't that make you just want to drink weird drinks and get tattoos and go to Eastern Europe and shit? This makes me want to do. That's why I became a rapper instead of a fucking insurance salesman. Yeah, what do you got? Wait, my own conception? You ever play that game where you count back from, you know, nine months from your birthday and you try to figure out what holiday your parents had sex on? Don't play that game, it'll fuck that holiday up forever. Um, yes, ma'am, what you got? Jeffrey Chaucer's The Canterbury Tale. Hip-hop. <laughs> What's that? In Middle English? Fuck off. I would be so pissed if it wasn't such a great topic. That's really awesome. Jeffrey Chaucer's The Canterbury Tales in Middle English. All right, my own conception. Jeffrey Chaucer's The Canterbury Tales in Middle English. What was the other one? Just, just what, what? The Russian meteorites. Yes, madam, what you got? The Ravens. Ravens. All right, I'll talk about the Ravens. I'll talk about the Ravens. Anybody upstairs? Yeah, what you got? RG3? Yeah. Come on, we don't have beef. We're like close, but we don't have beef. Like, you guys are in a whole different division. It's cool. You guys win all the time. We haven't won in 17 years. Lay the fuck off. And then the one thing that gave us a chance to win doesn't have a leg anymore. He's gonna be out there on a fucking one of those, one of those, you see a grandma with the dolly cart at the museum. He's gonna be out there trying to run the fucking pistol offense and it's gonna be a fucking disaster. But that's okay, because I'm a Redskins fan for the day I fucking die. I can only talk about RG2 very briefly because I talked about him last night in uh, uh, Falls Church, so we'll just keep that a little short footnote. Yes, what? Yeah, with the crazy hat. What's that? Chris Hansen? Ay, ay, ay. Alright, both. <laughs> she just stroked my shin. <laughs> I, that was thrilling and weird. Baltimore, you're just fantastic all the time. I had a revelation today when I was looking at Falls Church and I was thinking about Baltimore at large and I realized, like, thinking about the cities that I love and there's only a few cities in America that I really, really love and Baltimore is one of them. I really love it. And I'm not fucking pandering, I love it because it's fucking grimy and it's this, everyone's polite as fuck but they will totally fucking run your shit for a fucking ice cube. God damn it, I love it. And I started to think about it and it's fucking beautiful and grimy and it's got its own fucking unique culture, this weird ass music and you guys are like New Orleans and Baltimore. Baltimore is the New Orleans of the East Coast and New Orleans is the Baltimore of the South. You guys are fucking great. You're just so grimy and dirty and sweaty and I fucking love you both and I'm really stoked that I got to grow up around this one. So let's review. Uh, Chaucer's Canterbury Tales in Old English. Uh, middle English. Sorry, I'm sorry. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. You see how much whiskey I've had? Um, okay, so Ch uh, Chaucer's uh, Canterbury Tales in Middle English. Uh, the Ravens, RG3. Uh, the Russian Meteorite. Uh, my Own Conception. Uh, what was yours? Ravens. Oh, yeah, yours is Ravens. There's one more, right? What was that? I got the meteorite. What's that? Chris Hansen, cool. I got a metal plate in my head. I, I drink a lot of whiskey. I might forget these. You guys gotta remind me, okay? Um, we're gonna wrap over this little BB. Cause fuck it.
somewhere in the sand, so don't go fucking buck wild like it's fucking Thailand, you can't just start hitting on chicks that you meet on fucking MySpace, friends, so chill the fuck out, all of a sudden you sleep inside our house with some fucking Zimas, like, who wants the fucking party now, and next thing you know, this white guy comes out of the side room, and he's like, do you know exactly how this goal is, that you're making these moves, you fucked up, homie, and an asteroid ain't gonna save your ass, so you better fucking run and wait for the cops to tackle you in the grass, because if you made that fucking mistake, and you thought, well, Astronautilus told me that it would be great, because an asteroid's gonna kill me, so I better live my life in this place, you just be like, fuck that, you gotta draw some line inside this box and just chill for a second, take some time, wait till she's 18, son. As a matter of fact, if you're 30 fucking 5, wait till she's 30 fucking 3. Because if that age differential is too fucking big to see, then you don't have anything in common except that you're a fucking creep. So leave that by the fucking road and say it over in peace. What's the equation? Divide your age by half and add 7. If she's lower than that, then step the fuck away without a question. So move on to the side of the road, dip and say peace, because Chris Hansen's gonna fucking lock you up this fucking week. Woo! <laughs> 